All right, here's another uh, excavator video. And uh, we all know that Donald Trump got shot at again. We all know for some reason the guy was hiding in a bush for 12 hours waiting for Trump to go out and play golf at mar a Apparently, the guy volunteered and was over in Ukraine for a while. Probably didn't like the idea of Trump saying he was going to stop the war. So he brought it upon himself to bring about the end of Trump. So that... So that he... Uh, I'm about to drop the phone. So that Trump doesn't end the war. That's my guess. And drop the phone anyway. Okay. So anyhow, is a question for guns coast to coast. If the if the Secret Service had thermal imaging, binoculars in the daytime in Florida. Could they scan like the clump of bushes that this guy was hiding in for 12 hours and possibly found the guy hiding there with a rifle trying to cap Donald Trump? And if the answer is yes, and I kind of think it is, um, the question of the Secret Service is why don't you guys have thermals? And if the answer is it's not in our budget, can we uh, maybe take up a collection to get the Secret Service, Secret Service thermals so that they can uh, possibly see through bushes and uh, maybe even steep roofs and keep people from trying to shoot Donald Trump? And it's not just going to be shoot Donald Trump. I had a feeling if they this kind of thing continues, there's going to be a bunch of politicians getting shot at. And uh, a $5,000 pair of thermals, thermal imaging uh, binoculars can prevent a civil war. It's probably worth it. I mean, there'll probably be billions of dollars worth of damage to, like, every city in across the country if there is a civil war. So maybe buying thermals for the uh, maybe buying thermals for these guys, maybe that would be a good investment. Maybe I'd have a good return on, on the money. Anyway, that's my thoughts right now. As I listen to the uh, talking heads talk about everything as I dig this place out. Um, Kind of cool history on this house. Let me see if I can get a picture of it. That was the, uh, the guy who started Pfizer Pharmaceuticals. Um, this was his summer house, the summer weekend house. And uh, the guy who has it now is uh, getting up there in the years, and in order to sell it, here in New Jersey, it's got to have a new septic system. So we're putting in a new septic system so it can be sold. So if you choose to have a house of somebody famous, you know, a, house, a famous house with some history, um, this could be the house for you. Anyway, you all take care.